Libra, welcome to your bonus love reading for July 2022. For Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. We're going to see what's coming towards you. Who's thinking about you? Who wants you? Who wouldn't want a Libra? For those of you that are new, please go ahead and thumbs up my video, maybe leave a message of how it resonates by doing so, oh, and also subscribe. By doing so, I can pull in your energy as I meditate before every reading and bring more personal messages to you um, in future readings. All right, family love. I'm gonna pull a couple so it could possibly pull in a lot of your energies. Unchained love, I love that. It's like that releasing freedom kind of love. One that you just trust completely. Business love. For those of you that met through work and self-love. Love it. Always take what resonates and then always head over and watch your rising moon and Venus sign readings for additional clarity. to my Etsy shop is down below so anytime you feel like you need your own personal reading for clarity guidance answers I offer a variety of readings over there so just head over there and see what resonates with what you're going through all right Libra this is your energy and their energy and at the bottom of the deck is the Emperor so this person coming towards you, the person you might be dealing with or have dealt with in the past is, um, could be an Aries, a fire sign. This could be you knowing what you want in love. You've worked on yourself. You've worked on your stability and your self-worth and you love yourself. You want the ultimate offer. You want your empress. Take it how it resonates. You don't want to play games anymore. Strength. That's awesome because you could have fire in your chart, but it's you cutting out cycles that didn't work for you. You learning from the test of faith that were put in front of you. You could be reaching out to someone very quickly. Eight of Wands. You might want to make this rapid movement towards someone. Also, more fire energy. You want that equal give and take. You want to know that like what you put out in your love and in your effort, that they're going to reciprocate it back. And there's the Four of Swords. You've had some things happen to you, Libra. You've had to clear your mind. Meditate, take a break from dating, take a break from the experiences. But through that, you get clarity of what you truly want in a connection. All right, they're showing up the three of chalices. So you might meet them, you know, when you're out with your friends, your family, co workers. The Hierophant, they might have been married in the past. Or have been in a higher level of commitment. I just heard they could, they could have been put in a three-party situation. But they want their person. They definitely could be a fire sign. They want that higher level of commitment. They want to like rush in towards their person. Well, judgment is here. I feel like spirit is guiding this person towards you, Libra. Spirit is bringing this person towards you, aligning the two of you to come on each other's path. What else for my Libras? Yeah, there could have been an ending. A breakup. I 
this is somebody that you knew you know there was a breakup. But I really feel like this connection is coming towards the higher level of commitment. You have two eights here, three eights here. So pay attention to 888. Pay attention to where you're at at the time. Your, your thoughts. Within two to four weeks during the winter. January 22nd to February 21st. But it's wish fulfillment. It's going to be happy and peaceful. You're just going to get one another. Amazing communication between the two of you. Having so much fun with one another. Self-interest, stealth, deceit. Something's not right. I, I'm getting that in their energy. They went through something where they were pulled into a negative energy. Pulled into something that just wasn't what they thought it would be like. They were hurt. Well, that also could be your energy too, Libra. Because you learned, you've gotten some strength over your cycles. So, I do feel like there is going to be traveling involved towards one another. You could be a body of water away from one another. You could be at two totally different locations. But somehow, some way, you're at the right place at the right time for this to come together. Pay attention to ladybugs. Because this is good fortune coming your way in this connection, Libra. Good fortune. I have repeating threes, repeating eights, and repeating twos. And ten ten for judgment. Yeah, spirit's like, you know what? Your, your person... Yeah, there's definitely a few tens here. So this could be somebody from the past. And now their judgment call is being made. And like I said, right place, right time. Somehow, some way, they're going to be back in your energy. And there you are. Wanting things balanced. Wanting things feeling right. In the flow of each other. Definitely have taken some time out to meditate, relax, clear your head. Get that different perception on different perception on this. Loving yourself. For some of you, it could be two families coming together, meshing. I have two women here for those of you that resonate with the same sex. And then there's children and a dog. So it could be a meshing of family. If this is somebody from the past, it's coming back in an energy where you can trust it. It's going to feel liberating. No, like, not tenseful. You, and then I said, like, somebody you could be meeting at your workplace. There's that even flow of energy that Libra wants. That equal give and take. Celebrating this union. Fate it and divinely guide it, Libra, with the Wheel of Fortune here. You are meant to be on each other's path. You've put the work in when it comes to love. You've planted your seeds of what you want. You were your best self to most of the relationships in your life. And now it's your time to receive. And it's going to be like you sweep each other off your feet. Very romantic. Very loving. Exactly what I said. It's time for you to receive. For some of you, like in the Southern Hemisphere, your time is coming very soon. For others of you, leave past spring. We're in the middle of summer and it's hot. But 
You could have met this person in the spring if this is somebody from your past. Their birthday could be in the spring. You could be reconnecting with them next spring. But take it how it resonates. You're, if you are the Divine Feminine, you are looking for your Emperor. If you are the Divine Masculine, you're looking for your Feminine. And you allowed that healing to occur. Okay, let's see. A message from Libra's person. Spirit. A message from Libra's person to Libra. Okay, there's two. Always take what resonates, like I said. And then always head over and watch your Rising Moon and Venus sign readings. I can't stop thinking about you. And I remember every detail of that day. The day that was your first date. The date that you shared a kiss. The date that you had sex for the first time. The day that you fell apart. But they've never stopped thinking about you, Libra. All right, guys, let me know how it resonates. I will be back for many more readings and love and light. Stay safe.